Hello, my name is Cher Pastori and I'm a registered dietitian and certified diabetes educator with CAP Nutrition LLC in New York City. A pediatric dietitian is anyone who specializes in children under the age of 18, usually in an acute or a chronic illness. So for example, if a child has food allergies, you would be asked to help the child remove the foods from their diet and of course give them a well-balanced diet based on the foods that they can't eat. The, many children have many allergies. One of the most common is milk, so of course you would try soy-based products um, to help alleviate some of the problems. Also you could be a pediatric dietitian in a hospital-based setting. In that particular case, it generally involves a very acute illness, and sometimes the baby or child can't even eat at all, and they have to be fed nutrition through maybe a tube or through the vein just to sustain their nutritional needs. Further, you could consult um, maybe in uh, high school because, you know, children now are becoming extremely overweight. So you would have to go into the school to help them, give them um, guidance, maybe give them alternate snacks, help them avoid some of the high fat, high sugar foods that are out there so they can eat healthy, balanced meals. There is one particular diet that you Which can use located in the kitchen um, for children with um, autism. It's generally it is slightly controversial and very hard to follow. It's called the ketogenic diet. It is extremely challenging and, and slightly sometimes less you have to actually be in a controlled setting main responsibility in order is to, to do this. It's basically an extremely high protein diet and your body is breaking down and you produce this thing called ketones. It has been shown to work in terms of autism. For ADHD, it's not extremely well documented, but circumstantial evidence shows that you should avoid high sugar foods, anything processed, no sodas, and try to eat natural, unprocessed, low sugar foods.